hard. All right. This is gonna turn out. This is my second attempt. <laughs> I need fuel for the quad. And, uh, yeah. I want to um, thank Mark 4303, Mark's 4303, and Defobra. Man, oh man, they showed me an awesome time in New York City. And, uh, I'll put my visor down, I don't know. And, uh, how to blast with them in such a short, short period of time. That's why I like speed bumps. I got a quad. Those guys are so damn funny. Like I tell you, they, uh, they're, they're as if they were on camera or off camera. They're the same. It's just hilarious. So they were uh, so nice to me, and they took me down to Times Square and a whole bunch of cool things with you know tourist spots, right? So I'm very, very uh, happy that I got to visit with those guys, and uh, they put on a really good. Um, Welcoming. I posted a picture there um, on my Instagram. You know, welcome, uh, welcome the Canadian uh, Sapo and the uh, 2015 adult best movie star. <laughs> I love it. Uh, so that was great. So yeah, they put on a great, great uh, entertainment for me, uh, you know, showing me around, got to eat some typical New York pizza, which was really, really yummy, enjoyed it. Got to uh, hit a couple of delis, well, one deli that we went there quite a bit, food was awesome, love it, speed bump. for the cops though <laughs> and uh, so yeah those guys are great going down to use some of the the, um, the uh, train not the subway but the train and uh, lost track of my uh, thoughts there I don't know what happened <laughs> So the train and I uh, got to see go downtown, Times Square, all really cool stuff down there. And uh, I just really want to thank them so much. Uh, I couldn't uh, thank them enough. Okay, you just go ahead. Thank them enough for showing me such a great time. Putting, putting up with a Canadian. I don't know if they were looking for more uh, typical Canadian uh, accent, but I love the New York accent. I love it. And when we went into the deli there, everybody knew those guys. It was great. You walk in there and they're talking and chit-chatting and didn't matter everywhere it turned. It's like the, the, the locals, they were like saying, hi, how's it going? Good morning. And all that kind of stuff. So I had a blast. So anyways, yeah. So we went to New York. Take the train station down to, you know, we go through, um, can't think of all the stops. So we were in Long Island and we went through, uh, we went through uh, Jamaica, uh, I think Queens. I'm not sure where the train ran through exactly, but we ended up downtown and they showed me, they showed me, um, um, Times Square, 
So that was a, a pfft, New York is so big, so big. Like I've got we we got big freaking buildings, but they got so big, and then they got like flat screens on the side of the building. <laughs> Only in New York, you know what I mean. So it was really cool. I enjoyed that. Um, went for. Uh, um, had a couple of beers and some snacks and then from there we ended up riding uh, riding uh, some of these uh, city bikes which I thought was a really cool concept like you go and rent a bike you, you swipe your, uh, your your credit card and then you can rent the bike for 30 minutes and then you take it to another dock and then um, it's all kind of automated you put in your 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 pin yeah move motherfuckers we got the cops yeah Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I should look for some gas. I gotta go find some petrol. And uh, so yeah, we went on these city bikes, and of course, I said, I said we need to find some graffiti and get a photo. <laughs> the irony of on city bikes in downtown New York, and we found this one uh, particular. Um, uh, particular uh, graffiti which is the art is amazing <laughs> and it says rebel so here we are the has got his camera on I couldn't tell if I had my GoPro on or off but anyways and uh, these guys are like doing the whole show of uh, <laughs> the Fulber trying to do the 12 o'clock <laughs> I was doing it but he couldn't keep it up he needed a little blue pill of course <laughs> he couldn't keep it up <laughs> so that was awesome. Like this, the city itself is beautiful. Got to see the um, uh, the footprints of the the, the twin towers. So, man, oh man, that's just it's just amazing in itself to be there. Um, and they turned it into such a memorial, which was absolutely um, beautiful. I don't know. So that was great. So those guys put on a really good. Uh, uh, entertainment for me, lack of a better word. They showed me around and I uh, really appreciate the time that they took out to spend with me and uh, definitely gonna have to do it again. Uh, I think this time I'm not gonna rent a city bike. I'm gonna end up uh, traveling down there and I'm definitely gonna need a the Busa. <laughs> so I, I just gotta, gotta plan that trip. Of course, uh, quite, a, quite a far distance for me. It's like, if I were to take the Busa, uh, I'm, I'm just gonna guess right now, but I think I'm looking about 2,500 miles for sure to get to New York. And I could be wrong, it could be further, but again, I just wanna thank uh, DeFobre and, and Mark for uh, the hospitality and, 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 and they were just fantastic. So, loved it, absolutely loved it.